Hi, my name is Roger March. I'm VP Exploration with 4 Mining, and today I'd like to tell you a few things about VMS deposits. VMS, to start with, stands for Volcanogenic Massive Sulfide. Uh, so these are volcanically derived metal deposits that are hosted in volcanic rocks. VMS deposits, they form, uh, they form today, they formed over millions of years. You've probably seen pictures of black smokers, uh, things on the internet with black plumes of smoke coming out in the seafloor. So these uh, are uh, metal rich fluids. Uh, they're hot fluids that rise up and as they get close to the seawater they interact with the seawater and cool and as the, as the fluids cool they deposit metals and so that produces these sulfide rich mounds on the seafloor. You can end up with multiple deposits being formed as fluids come up in different spots. So that's a common um, common characteristic of VMS deposits is this clustering effect where you can get multiple deposits that are in pretty close proximity to each other. And that's one of the things that helps uh, VMS deposits build mining camps. So you have multiple deposits, you can set up a central processing facility and mine from various deposits which can range from 30 million tons to 3 million tons. Also because those, uh, those hot fluids are contain uh, many different metals, you end up with uh, copper, zinc, uh, silver, gold, lead, all mixed in these uh, sulfide piles. So the deposits have the advantage of um, multiple commodities, which allows you to take advantage of differences in metal prices. So in years when zinc is high, you can focus on your zinc resources. When copper is high, you can focus on the copper resources. So it gives you a lot of flexibility, and that's what makes uh, you know, VMS deposits attractive for major mining companies. McIlvena Bay is located in the Flin Flon Greenstone Belt. It's located in central Canada. It's a prolific belt. There's been mining there for basically for a century. Uh, there's been over 170 million tons of production from 29 past and present producing mines. So we're in a great place, great place to explore. Malcovena Bay itself is uh, now has a resource of just over 34 million tons. So that, there's a few points on uh, VMS deposits. Hopefully you're as interested in them as I am. And hopefully you follow what we're doing here at Foran as we continue to advance Malcovena Bay to production.